Once upon a time, in a far-off forest, there lived a colorful parrot named Polly. Polly was a beautiful bird with bright green feathers and a vibrant red beak. She was loved by all the other birds in the forest for her cheerful nature and her beautiful singing. Polly loved to sing and would often fill the forest with her sweet melodies. She also loved to play and would often be found flying around, chasing after butterflies and playing with other birds. One day, Polly overheard some humans talking about a bird show they were planning to hold in the nearby city. Polly had never been to the city before, and she was intrigued by the idea of performing in a show. She decided to fly to the city and try her luck. When Polly arrived at the city, she was amazed by the tall buildings, the bright lights, and the hustle and bustle of the streets. She found the venue where the bird show was being held and, after a brief audition, she was accepted as a performer. Polly was thrilled to be part of the show and spent many hours practicing her singing and her tricks. On the day of the show, she was nervous but excited. As she stepped onto the stage, she was greeted by a large audience of humans and animals. Polly began to sing and soon had the whole audience clapping and cheering. She performed all sorts of tricks, including flying through hoops and performing acrobatics in the air. The audience was mesmerized by her beauty and her talent. After the show, Polly received a standing ovation, and many people came up to her to praise her performance. Polly was delighted and felt like she had found a new home in the city. She decided to stay in the city and become a regular performer in the bird show. As the years went by, Polly became one of the most famous birds in the city. Her beautiful singing and her tricks continued to amaze and delight audiences, and she was loved by all who saw her perform. Even though she was far from her forest home, Polly was happy and content, knowing that she had found a new family and a new purpose in life.